Good morning, Hector Cap Ride Eagles. Today is Thursday, October 28th. It is day one of our specials rotation, and we are teaming up against negativity. We are in a positive mood. Absolutely. We are ready to do let's, this. Let's do it. Let's start by standing for the Pledge of Allegiance as Miss Sir's class introduces themselves and leads us. Amy, yeah. CJ, Ashley, Liam, Aiden. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for a moment of silence. You may be seated. All right, we are back for another day of teaching and learning here at Captor Island Elementary School, and I am so excited to be here. Are you excited? Absolutely. I see. Te teaming up for uh, against negativity, right? Against negativity, of course. And we're only about the positive here at yes. Caffarata. Which goes right with our three R's right there, responsible, respectful, and ready to learn. Um, I know we talked a lot about this week being kindness, which is against the positive, being positive, and mm -hmm. team against that negativity right there, which is wonderful. Yeah, and yeah. you know, Mr. Licata, you know, I understand that you're a Detroit <laughs> Lions fan, I, okay? I know. So I want to bring some positivity to your life, okay? Oh. And to our teachers, okay? okay? All right. So I am telling you this, okay? <laughs> Starting on Monday, okay? If the Buffalo Bills or the Detroit Lions oh my. win their game, all staff can wear jeans on Monday. Ooh. Okay? And you know what? Because I think your team is 0-7 right are, now. We okay? are 0-7, yeah. I'm going to even say this. And teachers, you can thank me. If your team wins, okay, they get a whole week of jeans. Oh, my gosh. So if the Detroit Lions win their game, a whole week of, of jeans. If the Bills win, then it's just one day. You know, wow. Okay. That's a big game this Sunday. It yeah. is. I guess the Eagles, I believe, against right? Eagles, okay. yes. So they, All right. They are 0 and 7 right now. Yep. And the Bills play the Dolphins. Yep. And so, you know, maybe some of the Miami Dolphin fans out there will start rooting for the Bills right. because they want to wear jeans. Let's see. All right, teachers, that's for you and all staff, actually, not just yeah. teachers. So if the Bills win, you wear jeans on Monday. And if the Lions win, you get jeans all week. Oh, a lot of pressure on my Lions. All right. Too, yeah. All right, we do have a happy birthday. That's something else positive. Today, our, our birthday is Joel Quiro, Quiroz Hernandez in grade two. So right. happy birthday. Happy birthday Joel. to him. And what's for lunch, guys? Today for lunch, we will have chocolate or white milk, pineapple or grape broccoli, Salisbury steak with mashed potato and gravy, and a roll of turkey wedge jelly sandwich. Wow, Salisbury steak. Salisbury I don't think I've had steak. one of those oh. since we had the, yes. the TV tray dinner um, and watching The <laughs> Wizard of Oz. microwave. Yeah. Microwave. No, we didn't have a microwave when I was oh. growing up. I'm going to be honest with you. We had to put it in the oven. So, all right. Um, today, we didn't do our science question yesterday, so we're going to do our science question today. So this is a call in and win opportunity. So we are back in the science lab. And the question is, which food below undergoes a chemical change, okay? Um, so the, the uh, answers are A, trail mix, B, fruit salad, C, hamburger, or D, melted cheese, okay? All right, so it goes into a chemical, chemical change. Chemical change. All right, you're on the air. Whose class is this? Hi, this is Mrs. Richard's class. And what do you think the answer is, Miss Richard? We think it's um, C, hamburger. It is C, hamburger. Congratulations to Miss Richard's class. Okay. The trail mix and fruit salad are ob obviously, those are mixtures. And when the cheese gets heated up, it melts, so it doesn't really change chemically. But the hamburger, when you cook it, it's, oh, we're calling somebody. Um, the hamburger, when you cook it, it's actually changed permanently. You can't uncook you a hamburger. Can't uncook it, yes. So that yes. is a that is a chemical change. All right, congratulations to Miss Richards' class. You guys have won a dress down day, and uh, go Lions and go Bills, so the teachers can wear their jeans. Let's see, and then one one last thing I want I forgot to want to give a shout out to one student. <laughs> so those of you who don't know, we had a bus that was like an hour late yesterday, 
And I want to give a shout out to fourth grade in Miss Sir's class, Melky Costante. He, by himself, organized a game for the kids. He did a little hot potato. Oh, awesome. And it was all on his own. It was wonderful to see him taking a leadership role and setting a good example. So a shout out to you, Melky for doing it all on your own right there. We love seeing that. That's awesome, awesome, awesome. Congratulations to him, and thank you for being what we represent here at Cafferata. Oh, teachers, one last thing. Just keep an eye on the weather. Um, Look for an email regarding recess and PE today and probably dismissal as we have some weather coming in this morning. Um, But we will give you more information when that happens. Have a great day, everybody. Don't forget that what, everybody? Smiles are free! Smiles are free, so have a great day. Happy Thursday.